Well, it took a little bit of time, but they are creeping back into that college football playoff conversation. The Oregon Ducks sitting 11th right now in the country. They're at home for a matchup that I think could present some problems in Washington State. Mike Am and Yogi Roth with you. All right, defensively here, we know that Oregon is going to have a challenge with Washington State scheme-wise. They've had some success against this Ducks team. What needs to happen so that doesn't occur, at least from Mario Cristobal perspective? Well, I think when you play against an air raid, you, you can't go in and be like, we're going to shut down Anthony Gordon. They're not going to do anything. Because that's not going to happen. They're going to complete the ball. Their version of their running game is the throw game. So he's going to complete it to Max Borg. He's going to complete it to some of his receivers on the outside or in the slot. Aesop Winston's going to get his. Sure. But when you get inside the 20, can you just not break? And that's the biggest part. Because when Anthony Gordon can anticipate, right, it's an in route to Desmond Patman. How many times have we seen that? Then you're in trouble. And that's what they were able to do. When you look at the last couple of years and break down the last four wins for Washington State, that they could thrive when they're down there a little bit. So to me, this is Oregon and Troy Dye and the linebackers, as well as, of course, Javon Holland in the secondary. But when they get in the red zone, to tighten up. Press coverage, try to disrupt the timing a little bit, get your hands up if you're playing the edge, Kayvon Thibodeau and company. Sure. If you can do things like that, like Utah did, albeit in the rain, that's when you have your best chance to beat Washington State. Agree or disagree, Oregon's been able to do what you're saying pretty much all season long in the red zone. Yeah, I mean, they're a talented defense, Mike. Yeah. They're one of the best in this conference. They're playing at a really high level. So I, I expect them to be able to do that in this ball game. And the, the reason why is you go back just to revisionist history, sure. right? It, it's exact, almost exactly a year ago, they beat Washington at home, go on the road, college game, it's craziness in Pullman, and they lose. And they get, I think they get blanked in the first half. You know, it just wasn't their type of game. Game. came back nice comeback almost got the victory and Mark Cristobal your boy you even talk about all offseason long of we're not buying into the hype our own social media etc they, they live that so I expect them to be their best version of themselves the challenge will be Wazoo is a new defense sure they're kind of a different team and they balled out against Colorado at home all right when this game is over got you covered Pac-12 network on final score but the conversation about the Ducks maybe being a college football playoff team Yogi and I have you covered all season long every single Tuesday do not miss inside Pac-12 football